Well, it's a pleasure to be here. I'm Marco, I'm from W Dubai, the Palm, uh, obviously from the beautiful Palm Jumeirah in Dubai. Thank you for joining us here on Breaking Travel News today. Perhaps for people who aren't familiar with Dubai the Palm, uh, you can give us an overview of what it offers. Yes, um, W the Palm is located at the West Crescent uh, on the Palm Jumeirah, at you know, the most amazing uh, site on the Palm or in Dubai. We have 349 rooms, <laughs> lifestyle luxury hotel, uh, part of Marriott International. Um, set somehow the lifestyle scene in Dubai and we are very keen to continue it now. That's great and do you have key sectors that you're looking to attract? We do. Um, our main focus, a little bit common to the Palm area is obviously the German market and the UK market and currently of course we're looking also very much into expanding a little bit to Asia since it starts opening up. And what do you have to offer? Is it for business travellers, family or a bit of everything? Now we're interestingly, the W brand itself is very much focused on couples travelling but since we're such a huge escape, uh, we, we can we cater to families as well. So we have a kids club, a little bit hidden so that the couples are not necessarily affected by it. So we kind of do a double dip there in our hybrid hotel between luxury lifestyle, which welcomes a lot of individual travelers as in couples, but at the same time families. That's great. And um, why are events such as uh, ITB here in Berlin important to showcase your brand? Well, it was overdue, right? Uh, during the pandemic, it was very hard when you connected via you know the video conferencing with your with your partners and having events like the ITB really really you know gives back the connection the human touch uh, you can exchange more freely what you can't really do when you're on uh, Skype calls so it's really nice to see the partners again and you know feel and get back to where we were before and how has recovery been post covid well, Dubai did very well, right? So we, thanks to the government, managed to open up very, very quickly while other markets were still closed. That gave us a little bit of a boost after we were closed the hotel itself for four months. Give us a boost and uh, frankly, we're still riding on this wave and we hope it's not going to stop very soon. That's great. And what do we have to look forward to from you in the future? We work on a lot of projects. In our hotel in particular, we're refurbishing our living room, our lobby. Uh, we add, we recently got the Michelin star in our Torno Subito restaurant by Massimo Cultura and also got listed with our Akira Beck restaurant onto the list of Michelin. We are opening um, a new rooftop bar very, very soon on the seventh floor, overseeing the skyline of Dubai and much more. Some exciting things to look forward to there. 100%. Finally, finally, do you have a message to our viewers here at ITB and beyond? Well, beyond. We're here, we're back, um, travel is back, so we're very excited to welcome everybody on the Palm to visit our hotel. Thank you very much for talking to us today. Thank you so much.